Hey everyone, so I am here. Sorry, I need to zoom out. Um, I just got, last week while I was away, my Luke's box or my Lux box or however you want to say it in the mail. So I wasn't here when I got it or when it first came in to do my review, but I got it and I opened it up again, but I haven't tried anything from in here. So you guys are going to be able to test it out along with me. So again, as always, it has the little um, card along with it. And at the top it says, The wait is over. Behold the August Lux box filled with hand-selected goodies for you. Um, um, it says, We are giving a select group of customers, including you, a shade of Pure Minerals 4-in-1 Press mineral makeup that matches your skin tone based on your beauty profile. So I filled out a beauty profile and I guess they got pretty much as close to my shade as possible. Why am I not focused? There we go, that's better. Um, they hope that they got the shade right and they'll send me a survey to see my feedback. They also sent me a thing of homemade earrings from Shayna Jewelry, which has been featured on Oprah's blog, and you can read more about the story at www.shayna.com. I'll put the link in the down bar. Now, I can't wear earrings, and I already saw them, so I gave them to my sister. They're, it was a cute little pair of pearl earrings, sort of dangly earrings, but not very dangly. I think they dangled maybe just about here. Why are you not focusing on me? better. Sorry about that. It just wasn't focusing. So that's that for that part. So without further ado, I'm going to open up my box. This week or this month instead of green, it's black tissue paper that I get. So opening it up. The first thing of course is my Pure Minerals 4-in-1 Pressed Mineral Makeup. Skip the mess and Go pressed with Pure Minerals award winning foundation powder and concealer and SPF 15. Supercharged with shea butter and vitamin E, this nourishing pressed mineral formula is key to flawless looking skin in 30 seconds or less. So I got it in blush medium. Looks like that. Here's the real test if it's gonna match my skin tone. Let's see. Blends in pretty well with the skin on my hand. I know that's not always a good test. So let's go right along there. Oh, that's actually pretty good. So I like that. Looks like that. And this is just the sample size. I've seen the full sizes of these. And they're, I think, about that big. So I'll try this out a bit more. I'm probably going to use it as um, a setting powder more than... I'll try it as a foundation on its own, let you know what I think about it. But I'm probably going to continue to use, which I forgot to mention to you guys a while ago. I don't know where it went. I'll use this for now. Oh, there it is. Right behind my mirror. It's my Inglot um, Cream Foundation. It's just their standard cream foundation, looks like that. And I bought this the weekend I went to the Baxter Brooks concert. I didn't do any shopping that weekend, although we did stop just so I could specifically get this. This is my favorite all-time foundation. I'll probably do, not maybe not a review because I've used this before. It'll be sort of a review and sort of an information about the product itself and the line and Inglot itself. Um, I'll try and get some information for you about that. But yeah, I'm probably still going to use this and this is in the color number 24 because they use numbers rather than actual color names. Anyways, away from Inglot, I was just letting you know that I'm probably going to use the Pure Minerals as a setting foundation. The next thing is Lip Plumping Treatment from City Lips by City Cosmetics. The award-winning formula in City Lipsticks includes Oligopeptide technology to increase collagen production in your lips. 
resulting in greater lip volume and, to, and a decrease in wrinkles and lines in and around the lips. Get extraordinary results and a luxury lip gloss all in one. So I'm going to quickly try this out. I've never tried a lip plumping or a lip plumper before, so I'll let you guys know what I think. Kind of tingles. Smells like vanilla, which I like. I love the smell of vanilla. Most of my stuff from Bath and Body Works, actually all the stuff I own from Bath and Body Works, is in the warm vanilla sugar. Um, I don't see much difference yet, but I'll leave this on and we'll see what happens. Um, this was the little thing that the earrings came in. It's a really cute package. I kept that at least to show you guys. Um, There you go. That's what the front looks like. I'll probably put the link to the website in the down bar below. It was just this little cute envelope with a little pair of earrings. I would have hoped that it was a necklace or something, but beggars can't be choosers. The next thing is a full size thing of the Proclaim Cocoa Butter Hand and Body Lotion. Proclaim Hand and Body Lotion moisturizes dry, irritated skin while protecting from sun, wind, and water. It restores lost moisture and soothes dry, tight skin, leaving skin feeling smooth and soft without feeling greasy. So this has aloe vera in it, and it says it also has panthenol and wheat germ oil. Sorry about that, my camera died out on me. But the Proclaim um, Cocoa and Shea Butter, it probably smells like cocoa butter and shea butter, but at first it didn't really smell like much, so it smells like cocoa butter. Um, but when you pull it out, it's not as thick as I thought it was going to be. It's more milky than anything, When, because I would have thought it was more like a body butter. But it is very moisturizing, or at least it feels like it's very moisturizing. My hands have been really dry since I came back to the beach back from the beach, sorry, I should say. And I find they've just been devoid of moisture from the, um, what's it called? The, um, salt water in the ocean. So the last thing I got was Calvin Klein Forbidden Euphoria Fragrance. Mysteriously sophisticated, innocently seductive, coveted yet forbidden, this fragrance is the younger interpretation of the iconic Euphoria Fragrance. It evokes a modern, fresh sexiness with a mystery twist. So, I just got a little sample size like that. And does this one have the roller? I hope so. So it has the roller, so it's not a spray or anything. Oh, I like that. I, I really, really like that. Do they have a, another description of the scent on here? No. Okay, so I'll probably put the um, description of the scent in the down bar if I can find it, because I'm not really good. Yeah, I can't really tell you exactly what it smells like, but I like the smell. I know that much. Okay, so my lips are kind of looking plumper, and I can feel the um, lip plumper working. And my lips do kind of look smoother than they did before. Okay, so the lip plumper does work. Um, it just needs a couple minutes to sort of work and get started. Um, I'll put a list of everything in the down bar, and I'll let you guys know how much each thing in their full size costs. So this here was... I'm trying to see what the weight was. So this was... 0.15 ounces and the full size is 0.28 ounces so this is the small sample size but the full retail size at 0.28 ounces is $31 now for a setting powder or foundation I don't know if I pay $31 I'm gonna let you know if later on if I think it's worth it 
but this, if you're wondering, is $31 for the full size, regardless of color. For the City Lips Lip Plumping Treatment, a 5 milliliter container of this, I think I have, doesn't say which one I got, but I, pro I de this is definitely the sample size. I think 5 milliliters is like your standard lip gloss size, is 35. Um, okay, so this is a sample size. It is 3 fluid ounce. The full size is 32 ounces, so it's probably something like a bottle like that, probably nice and wide, so there a lot comes in the full one, and it's only $8 for the full size. So this, I would probably buy again in the full size retail, just because it is only $8, and as a student, I go for sort of the best deal. So at $8, I, I would even buy this size at $8, so... Something bigger at $8, I would love that. And then the Calvin Klein Forbidden Euphoria Fragrance. For the 50 milliliter bottle, which is the small bottle, so I think the small bottle is only like that big, like that. It's. I'll show you the picture. That's what the um, bottle looks like. So I think the 50 milliliter is only like that, and then like that. That one is $78, and the large size, which is probably longer and a bit wider up, is $102. So, unless I had a gift card, I probably wouldn't get that one. Um, so that's everything I got in this Lux box. Again, I'll put the all the information from this card in the box, or in the down box, and I will also put the website for the... Um, jewelry that came with it from Shayna. So I'll let you guys know about that. Hope you guys enjoyed my um, looks box haul and I'll see all of you guys later. Bye!